Okay, so this is my favorite and my current mobile video recording rig. Uh, so it comprises a few different components. This is a Rode Video Micro. This is a Hisey or Hissy, I'm still not sure how you pronounce that, uh, Bluetooth remote for the phone. So it's a trigger, remote trigger. This is the uh, cable SC adapter. Basically, I don't know the model number offhand. I'll try to put it in the links below. Uh, this is a, an adapter that allows you to plug it into your phone so that um, you can work, you can use the video micro with your phone. Uh, this is an SP Gadgets phone adapter. Uh, it's also currently attached to a GoPro ball mount. So this swivels around and it gives you some different options there. Uh, this came with my session. So I'm not sure if you could buy that separately, but again, it's a GoPro ball head. Uh, and then this this piece here is the SP Gadgets uh, phone mount. Over here, what we have is a flash bracket from Rocketfish. I bought this on clearance from Best Buy for less than 10 bucks. Um, it's a flash bracket with a cold shoe mount on the top uh, there. And then what I have is a basically a GoPro adapter mount mounted to the quarter inch thread. Uh, and then I have a, an adapter. Oh, actually, no, this is a quarter inch as well. So this just screws right on. So then what you can do here with this particular setup, and of course my iPhone, but what's cool about this setup is, you know, it breaks down into all these little individual pieces. So you can break this down and it's, you know, portable in the sense that uh, you can just sort of have all this in like a small bag. You know, and if you take off the windsock for this, for instance, you know, this whole kit sort of fits like this. I mean, it's it's compact. You know, there's your phone, just in reference, uh, size-wise to all of the gear. And then what we can do is, we'll just set this up real quick. So then you basically set this up like so. Then you'll snap on the GoPro adapter, like yay. Uh, what I did was I put a little Velcro on the back of the re re Bluetooth remote and then uh, basically put a little Velcro strip here for the other side so that I can just attach the the remote there. So you can see it sticks to the side. And then what you do is you attach the, basically put the screw on the video micro to the flash mount or to the cold shoe. And then there's your setup, kind of completed setup without the phone. And then of course, if you're shooting outdoors, you want a wind furry sock to protect, uh, so the wind doesn't mess up your audio. Uh, but that's pretty much the whole setup. And then what you can do is you slap the phone in, boom. And there's your rig. Your whole rig is right here. Basically, run the adapter into the headphone jack on the iPhone to get the audio in. And then what we do is just move that out of the way. Um, so now you have basically the rig like that set up. And what you can do is once you're in video mode for the phone, you can either automatically hit the button there and just start recording. So now it's recording. Um, or conversely, you have the trigger now on the top. So if you're recording this way, you can just simply, and what we'll do is do this so you can see and take the windsock off. But what you can see is, and I'll try to set this up in a way you can see. So if you press the button on the trigger, you have a remote trigger. Boom, recording. Stop recording. So this is a Bluetooth remote, like I said. And then if you basically attach this or move this somewhere else, you mount this onto another. It's got a quarter inch in the bottom. So if you put this away from you and you need to trigger the audio, then you can just take the remote with you and then fire, fire, fire the audio remotely. So this is, like I said, kind of my favorite. I've gone through a lot of different renditions of this thing. Um, even have a kind of a more expensive piece of kit which is a B script with a wide angle. Um, but I actually find that uh, this, if you don't need an external lens or a, um, 
a different lens option, I actually find that this is a little more versatile because you can just, like I said, break it down. It's much more compact in terms of the pieces. Uh, with the ball head in place, you can sort of, you know, maneuver this as you need to, depending on the angle. And if you're shooting this way and you want to maybe like, for instance, narrate something that you're shooting, you can always just flip the, the micro around instead, shoot from the, from the other angle, or you can just selfie mode and do it this way, flip this, and then you're recording yourself. Hey. Um, so again, bunch of different options. Uh, this is kind of, like I said, uh, my current Inspector Gadget edition rig. So I just wanted to share that uh, because like I said, all the pieces combined are sort of like MacGyvered, uh, all different from different places. But again, just to recap, this is the Video Micro Hi-C Bluetooth remote, uh, flash bracket, GoPro uh, SP mount for the phone uh, with the GoPro uh, uh, quarter inch tripod adapter. So again, if we just break it down, I want to break it down, break it down. We'll just break down these pieces again, sort of so you can see how quickly it sort of breaks down. Boom, boom, boom. And then, I mean, some people could solve Rubik's cubes faster than this, but like I said, it's still pretty, pretty convenient. Pack it all up, put it away, and away you go. So, hopefully that was cool. If you found that helpful, thumbs up. Would appreciate it. Uh, and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.